Tonight, we were at the scene of a series of car break-ins by Universal Studios in Orlando. I'd like to give you some tips of how not to become a victim of a car break-in. Hello, welcome to NurseWorks in association with Tropical Pine Tree. Tonight, I want to talk to you about something a little serious. Tonight, my son and I had gone out for a cup of coffee over at the local Starbucks. We just happened to be over by Universal because that's close to our house. And we were in a busy Starbucks restaurant and there were many, many cars and many people drinking their coffee outside. And we were just enjoying ourselves when a squad car comes rolling up quickly and a policeman jumps out and runs over to the whole crowd sitting there and asks if we saw three men running and nobody had and they said there was people breaking into the cars right in the lot behind us and fortunately they didn't get into our car but we were able to catch a lot of the action on the 360 camera and we're going to be uploading that as soon as possible so you can see what actually happened just a couple hours ago in Orlando by Universal Studios but I wanted to tell you how to protect yourself from becoming a victim of a car break-in. A couple of easy things you can do is to always lock your car and roll up your windows. And don't leave anything visible in your car. Bring in your GPS. Don't put it in the glove department box. Use a wet wipe and clean off suction cup marks. They're easy to see at night they will make your car be a target to thieves. Well, what if you are a victim? What should you do? Call 911 and don't go into your car. Don't touch your car because there may be fingerprints and the police would want to be able to actually take a look at it as well and with you to see what's been missing. What if you're walking and see someone breaking into your car? Again, call 911. Don't approach your car. There might be other people assisting that thief. Get to a safe place. I can't say that strong enough. Don't go and try to stop a crime. They may have a gun, a knife, you don't know. And there's something else you should know. A lot of times a thief will come during the day and throw a rock at a car to see if an alarm goes off. If there is no alarm going off, they know it's a pretty safe target to come back later at night and break in. These are just some things I want you to know to be safe and to be aware of. Thank you for watching. Please like us and subscribe. Our website is www.tropicalpinetree.com. Consider becoming a Patreon and supporting us in our endeavors. I'm a single mom, so all this comes out of my pocket and my time. We do have a Facebook site. It's www.facebook.com at NurseWorks Magazine, Florida.